Because you've seen Peter Sutcliffe in that. Oh, yeah, um, Peter. Do Pe- you, you see his eye getting took out? Yeah, yeah, I was there, yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, that day there, yeah, for me, uh, was like a scene out of a, um, Silence of the Lambs. You know, Anthony Hopkins? Yeah, 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 it was. <laughs> because the thing is, yeah, the guy who done it, yeah, I was talking to him just before, it's a big dinner night tonight and it's steak, it's uh, cauliflower steaks, there's chips and peppercorns. So Peter's there sitting down going like this and he's just, he's walking up and down like angry. So I said, sit down, sit down, man. He goes, I don't want this food, I want liver. So I says, liver? They don't, you have to order that from the kitchen, they probably be tomorrow now. So he looked at me and goes, no, that's what I did. I cut someone up, disemboweled somebody and I hit their liver. So I'm like, bro, like, you want to talk like that, yeah? Leave me alone, because I'm having my food. Uh, later on, we'll talk about all your your mad killings and all that, yeah? I won't say his name, because obviously, you know. But he's, uh, he ain't having it. So he's come up behind Sutcliffe, held him there, took his eye out with, with a fork, and hit it. So the nurse is standing there like that, and the pus from the eyeball is going into her face. She's ran off the ward, all the staff ran off the ward. Left all the patients there. So I was like, I don't give a shit, man. I'm just eating my dinner now. Peter's there crying, the cord of the eye is still connected to him there. Like, you know, it was just, it was savagery. But then once I saw that in, right in front of me, I just thought to myself, I can't never uh, be on point in there. So every day that I was there, I always thought to myself, what is the last thing you're going to think if one of these psychopaths kill you? Let it be about God. Let it be about your mum or your family or your granddad because you don't know when you're going to die.